Today, we have someone new moving onto our piece of land here on the side of a mountain in Panama. Sweetie, Rod's here. Hi. This has always been our dream, to live together with other like-minded people and help each other with the little things in life, whether it's taking care of animals or looking over things while the other person is gone. But recently, we've been more focused on creating the basic necessities of a happy life here on our homestead, and we couldn't be more excited for what we accomplish in this one. Well, we've saved the hardest part in the shower for right now. This is like the make it or break it moment where the shower's either gonna look great or it's gonna look like two amateurs <laughs> slap some tile together. Let me just take a nice little seat here on our little seat here. Check it out, check it out. So you see these two knobs right here? These two bad boys, we're gonna have to tile around these. It's gonna be a little complicated. What I'm gonna do is put this tile right here above the knob and then mark exactly where we need to cut. If this piece covers up the hole, then we're good, sweetie. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, perfect. Oh yeah, baby. That's gonna look so good. I don't care what it freaking takes, honey. We are finishing this tile for this video. Kaylee's been resorting to finger painting the thin <laughs> set on. Just for the, the really like tricky ones, you know? I mean, let's just be real, sweetie. You just wanna do pottery. So bad. <laughs> so bad. <laughs> Get it right, get it right, get it tight. We've gotten past the hard part. Now, it's just straightforward. Straightforward. Video. Straight lane tile. Yep. You ready to time lapse this thing? Let's do it. Say there's someone behind you. There's someone right behind you. <laughs> I think she wants some of your lollipop, Bubba. <laughs> you want to give her some lollipop? No. You, know, you want it all to yourself? Sadie's double fist in the lollipops. She took mine. She likes doing the back and forth between the cherry and the strawberry. Can't blame her. <laughs> <laughs> Say, you have some of that lollipop? No. Please? No. But you, but you got two. Can I have one while you have one? Hey. For any of you guys that lay tile for a living, I have two very serious questions for you. Number one, how do you lay tile without a laser? I feel like if we didn't have this thing, this would take so much more time and it would look so much sloppier. I just don't know how it's possible. I feel like Without this laser level, we'd be in for a world of hurt. And number two, why are you watching two people who don't know how to lay tile, lay tile? Like, Honey, don't discredit us. We're doing a fantastic job. I'm just saying, if you're laying tile all day, and then you go home and you watch people lay tile. Oh, you're laying tile is a very tedious thing. You're specifically talking to the tile Lay layers. Laying professionals. I'm just joking, you guys, but if you lay tile out there, shout out to you, because this is tedious as heck. Doing this day in and day out must be a grind. But if there's one thing I've learned, it's that if you do something with your hands nowadays and you do a trade, there's a lot of people who need tradesmen, so I'm sure you're busy. Can you say broom? Broom. 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 It's a broom. Thanks for cleaning up my mess, Bubba. Honey, I genuinely feel like the quality of our lives had, has increased, have increased, has increased at least 100% percent since having our espresso machine. Because there truly is nothing better than being able to make your own iced latte, middle of the day. If you think about it, the amount of work that we're getting done has maybe gone up like, I might say 100%, but like two or three times. You want me to go up the ladder? Yeah. I'll go up the ladder with you. Give me a kissy, upside down kiss. You know that saying like, blondes have more fun? Yeah. Coffee drinkers have more fun. <laughs> So I think today's gonna be one of those days where we do a little bit of a flip-flop, taking care of Sade. We're, it's almost two o'clock now, so the day's still young. If we're working till midnight again tonight, honey, there's a possibility we could finish this and start on this wall today. If you wanna to go till midnight, that espresso machine's gonna be going overdrive, baby. I'm getting <laughs> caffeinated. <laughs> Oh 
Okie dokie, Smokey. Do you have the egg? You're in charge of the egg, okay? Are you enjoying that butter? Is that good? Mama, You want me to do it? Yeah. Can you try it? Yeah. You try. Put it in. Perfect, baby. Okay, go put that in the trash now, okay? Go ahead, pour it in. Shake it a little bit. Pour it in the other way. A little bit more? Yeah. Might not be that good, baby. <laughs> we gotta we gotta put the butter in it first, okay? In the water? Yeah. Okay. Eat right. the butter. You're eating the butter? How is it? Is it good? <laughs> I think I'm alright. Thank you though. I, I'm gonna I put some butter in there. I'm gonna have some butter in there, okay? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, fourteen, fifteen, seventeen. Seventeen muffins we're gonna have. It's actually insane how much I love this human being. I love you so much. Okay, baby, now we're gonna fill up the tan with a little muffin, and then we're gonna bake them in the oven. Bake them in the oven at 350. American chop suey has gotta be the most underrated classic American meal. By the way, I'm a little bit sad. My muffins came out a little bit overdone. Yeah. Here you go. That one's for you. That one's for you, babe. Cheers. All three, right, cheers. I feel like when we build our house, we're gonna like, I feel like we should purposely build like a Japanese style dinner table. That'd be pretty, that'd be pretty cool. <laughs> There's something about like eating on the floor. How many fingers am I holding up? One. <laughs> Look again. One, two, three. Three. Five. I think you've had one too many. <laughs> 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 I've been tiling for 14 hours today. For the last 10, I've just put my head down and just attacked this thing. I haven't really even been filming that much. I haven't even taken that many shots. So I just wanted to get this whole back wall done. To be on pace, to have this shower done by the end of this video, we needed to have this back wall done. And if you look, we are almost there. Just three pieces left right there. But right now, it's 12.09. I just cut a tile and I almost cut my finger off. So I was just like, I gotta stop. It's getting dangerous now. So I'm calling it here, closing it up for the night. And we'll finish this up tomorrow. staying up so gosh darn late. We literally tiled till almost midnight last night. And, and then we stayed up till two in the morning just chit-chatting away. And then we woke up at eight. I'm a little, I gotta be honest. I'm a little cranky right now. I'm a little tired, uh -oh. I'm a little cranky. But I'm only about a quarter of the way through my coffee, so.
This is the last piece. Forever? No. No. <laughs> We still got a long way to go. No, I know. But this is the last piece of the hard side. Come on, baby. Give me some of that. Ah. Oh. Looks so good, honey. Look at that. This little guy <laughs> is the last tile on this wall. Oh my god. I mean, are we going overboard on this, sweetie? We might be a little bit overboard. Well, look, look, look at right there. Is that? You know, you can't just fill that with bread. You gotta get, you gotta get that in there. All right, get that in there, honey. Get that in there. <laughs> oh my God. Hold on, I gotta, I gotta move it over. You know, Sadie's always gonna look up at this tile and be like, it's so little. Oh <laughs> my God. That's Sadie's at the age now where she's starting to have an imagination and she plays imaginary play all day long. She pretends to hold little babies and little animals and she'll be holding her pretend whatever and she'll be like, it's so little. Dude, let's just steamroll this thing. Like, I feel like we could just smash this whole wallet, wallet this day. We just put our heads down, just stay focused on it. Maybe we gotta put Sadie in the bath again. Sweetie, we are 100% finishing this wall today. You said that we're not gonna stay up till two in the morning again. No, I never said that. <laughs> I said we just got, we probably gotta start stopping to do that pretty soon, but not until the shower is done. <laughs> I am scrambling right now to make a coffee really, really quickly because I actually had my first ever conversation with YouTube. We've been making YouTube videos since 2017, so that's six years, and never once have I talked to YouTube. Oh, we're good girl. Right here is where I'm going to set up shop right next to my three dogs. <laughs> you, must be you must be Daniel. Nice to meet you, Jordan. Nice to meet you too. How are you doing? Well, the representative told me I basically can't put anything from the video in there, so none of that footage is actually going to make it in because it's all confidential. Basically, let me tell you why I wanted to talk to YouTube. Um, I talked to a representative from YouTube, and why I wanted to talk to him was we made a video last week talking a little bit about the protests that are happening here in Panama, and YouTube flagged them as containing violence and basically suppressed them. Made it so like no ads can play on it, they stripped all the money from it, which then basically means that YouTube doesn't promote it out and... I don't really care that much about the views or the money or any of that, but I just wanted to hear what they had to say about suppressing, talking about protests um, and flagging protests as violence because there was no violence. Uh, it was shots of people dancing in the street. Uh, it was shots of a woman saying, you know, we're desperate and that's why we're protesting. It's everything of what a protest is, but so to just immediately flag a protest as something that's violent to me is concerning for someone who spends a lot of their time contributing to this platform and it's kind of the answers that you'd expect, basically non-answers and protests are important. Sharing protests are important. Sharing, um, I mean, even, even see, even now me talking about it, I'm thinking about YouTube doing it again to this video. Um, and that just concerns me because I think self-censorship is kind of what, is what they're looking to do here. To me, it's not gonna censor me. Like, I just wanna share my life. I wanna share it exactly how it is, the good, the bad, the ugly, the beautiful days, the protests, what it's like living in another country. Welcome to the life of making YouTube videos and trying to solve the wild mystery of YouTube. <laughs> So Rod and Freddie should be showing up any minute and I've been coming in here every day to just make sure things are looking good, you know? He's bringing a woman here, so I want to make sure, you know, I add a little woman touch of cleanliness in here. One thing that Jordan and I absolutely are taking away with inspiration from Rod's house is this big window wall 
right here. This whole wall is just windows. And with the view that we have up here, I feel like that's just absolutely necessary with any structure that we build here on Lola's farm. I feel like the wall facing the volcano just, it has to be glass. That's just absolutely mandatory. On the hammock. On the hammock. Yeah. That's funny. Yeah. Can you show me what colors you see on the hammock? Pink. And, and blue. And blue. Come on. <laughs> and he, he only likes to be pat. Wow, that is actually insane timing. Just as we walked to the door, Rod and Freddie just pulled in the driveway. Yeah. You want to go see Rod and Freddie? Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. 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 Hello. <laughs> We're going to go say hello. Yeah. <laughs> Rod and Freddie are here. Shirt in there, so don't worry, it's not like Santa Claus. <laughs> 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 That's a good cover up, huh? She's got your back. Who is tough as oh, a bitch? <laughs> Initiation, Lola's Farm Initiation Nectar Tea, aka Lola's Farm Kool Aid. Wow. And you have to drink it in order okay. to, to be, be part, part of, of okay. this cult. <laughs> I will. <laughs> Thank you very much. It's actually just cascara. <laughs> it's just cascara tea. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I, I heard about that. <laughs> it's really good. So it's I made, like it. it's made. Have you ever had it before? Okay. Nope. Never, it's made from the, it. um, it's made from like, you know, the coffee plant how you pick the red fruit mm -hmm. and it's the skin it's like the red oh. skin i like it that it's not sweet mm. it it's like tamarind yeah and pomegranate it does i know we're gonna get this <laughs> <laughs> i have a bag of it so do you go by Feder federica or freddy both actually okay i think here it's freddy freddy is easier. that's yeah. more like yeah. you know the casual yeah way. i think that's <laughs> easier for sadie too I think so. definitely she said it actually super clear all right first question yeah if you could be mm -hmm. any vegetable in the world, what would you be and why? I would be a broccoli. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't know, I just love them. <laughs> All right, this one's a little bit, this one's a little bit more loaded, okay? Okay. All right. So what made you decide you wanted to drop everything, move to a hippie <laughs> commune in the middle of the jungle in Panama, and come, come be here? That's a difficult one, but I think it was mostly him. Yeah, Aww. Rodrigo. This guy, you, for sure. you're just pumping. You're just pumping him up. Okay. Rodrigo, you're like petting your chest hair. You don't have any chest hair. Do you want to see it? <laughs> All right. And this last, this last and final question is a question we ask everybody. Okay. What do you want to be when you're older? Happy. Aww. That's the best answer so far. Do you guys give the exact same answer? Yeah, we did. You guys both said you wanted to be happy when you yes. grow up? What? what do you want to be when you grow up? I just want to be happy, bro. You just want to be happy? I just want to be happy. That's I don't... That's the only thing that I want. That's the I best want to answer. be happy. That's the best answer. That's what it's all about. Give me five. <laughs> We're happy to have you, Freddie. We're so happy to have you. I'm happy so, too. So, so happy to have you. <laughs> I'm happy too. What did you get, baby? You got a present from Freddie. Two, three. Gosh. Is that her first Lego set? It is! It is? Yes! Oh That's her first ever Lego yes. set! Oh my god! Oh my god! Thank you so much! That's awesome! It's just so good to see Rodrigo so happy. Uh, he's been with us through so much and we've been with him through so much over these last three years now. But those guys are gassed. They've been traveling, they've been flying and uh, our time together was short so they're heading off to bed but I want to keep going on this. I want to get this tile done. I'm also gassed. I'm close to the most tired I've ever been. I, um, we're just pushing super hard. Just want to get this tile done. 
want to get this bathroom done. We want to just make this improvement in our lives. Good morning. Feeling a little lost this morning. I don't like not having my hat on. Just feeling like it's gonna have this hair flumping all around. I don't like it. That's how it's gonna be. Because if you see my hat, this is a. Uh, this is the current status. It might be time to retire that one. It's crazy what a good night's sleep. I I know, honestly, honey. <laughs> like I'm ready to go up till 2 a.m. again. Tonight. No, we got. To, I, I think. <laughs> I think the whole thing is we just gotta stop doing that. We gotta stop doing that. Yeah. I think I definitely underestimated the amount of time it would take to freaking clean. I feel like it takes more time to clean than it does to actually lay the tile. We've put down like 375 tiles. Dang. That's a lot of tiles. That's a lot of tiles. <laughs> Not only the tile, but in each crevice of the tile, which is even more. <laughs> okay, so this is the mission for the day, finishing this wall. I honestly can't remember, honey. Did we promise them that we were gonna be done the tile for this video, or we were gonna be like done, done the shower? Cause you're starting to think about the grout now. <sighs> and this is a 48 hour dry time before we get the grout. No. <laughs> Anytime Jordan and I have a bag of nectar, it just disappears because we drink it so, so fast. If any of you guys don't know what cascara is, it's actually a tea that's made from the coffee fruit. So they take the skin from the fruit of the coffee and they dry it and turn it into a tea. And it tastes like brown sugar and pomegranate. It is so, so dang good. And another little added bonus, it's really, really high in antioxidants. So it's actually super good for you too. Here we go, you guys. This is the last tile. This has been hands down one of the hardest things I've ever done. The amount of time you have to put into each tile to make sure it's absolutely perfect. I couldn't be more excited than to put this tile in. Done. That's what I set my goal for today was to get this done all the way up to the roof and we did it. I absolutely love how this shower is looking and genuinely couldn't be more proud. I just want to let you guys know that we just put up 200 bags of this coffee cherry tea for sale up on our website. So for any of you tea lovers out there, this stuff is absolutely delicious. So click the link down in our description below. Thank you guys so much and we'll see you guys in the next one. Mwah.